We just got back and look what came in the mail. I hired a guy off of Fiverr to help us get tickets for the Ghibli theme park. I had him pick them up earlier and send them to our Osaka address because we're going to Nagoya tomorrow to visit the park. Ooh, so here are the tickets. It actually kind of reminds me of those uh, train tickets that Chihiro had in Spirited Away. Babe. These are vouchers to Wendy's. Give me two dollars off. to Nagoya. So we ended up getting non-reserved tickets instead of reserved seats just because this lets you take any train at any time and didn't think it would be too crowded which it looks like it's not. So it was very easy to find seats on the non-reserved car. Definitely suggest doing this if you want to save a little bit of money and be a little more flexible in your travel plans. <laughs> We've arrived in Nagoya and we still have a little bit of time so we're actually gonna go get some coffee and try out morning service which is a local specialty and tradition here. I'm trying to find Kometa coffee because morning service ends in five minutes but I don't think we're gonna find it because we're basically in a maze right now. Okay we found it we just don't know how to get inside. See here? Oh yeah that's well, big. Hopefully we're not too late. So you can pick one of these coffees and then it comes with a free morning set which is essentially any kind of bread you want and then you can pick like red bean paste, egg paste, egg and then butter jam. And this is all complimentary included with your coffee if you come before 11 but we are here at 11.03. We ran here and it's 11.05, but it was worth it. They still let us have it. Mm. Arigato. This is so cute, baby. <laughs> it's mine. Eh? Yeah, it's so cute. Very confusing. have made it to the expo park after a very long journey from Osaka. Are you excited? It's like going to Disneyland but better. Here's our magical portal. Do you think we can sneak into the other parts of the park? We can try. It's gonna be hard because there's <laughs> nobody here. <laughs> It's definitely quite empty today. 
Doesn't seem like there's too many people. Today we're going to the Grand Warehouse, which is the main area, as well as Princess Mononoke, which I do not know where it is, but it's somewhere on this. Unfortunately, Valley of Witches is going to open in March, so we can't go, and we did not get tickets for Hill of Youth or the other areas, but it's okay. You can see the Valley of Witches way over there because there is Hell's Moving Castle and Kiki's bakery area, but this isn't going to be open for another couple months, so we're not seeing it today. I think we may have found the line. You from there? Talk to me. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. We got the. I guess there's a little bit of a benefit to being late because we get to enter now instead of waiting with everyone. So long, peasants. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Arigato gozaimasu. Mm. Oh, arigato. We are in. Here is our ticket to the short film later. <laughs> oh, they weren't kidding when they said there were a lot of lines here. I'm not sure what we're supposed to do. Like a little handwritten map in here. They explain some of the different areas. I try and start at 15 and work our way backwards. Guards Laputa. Who's that? Castle in the sky. Where's that castle? In it's the in the sky. sky. Yeah, you can't see it. So they have lots of little details in here, like the bathhouse tickets. You can see her long cigarettes that she smokes over there. Looks like we have like a little radio station here. I'm not sure what this is for. So this is where you can buy little milks and red bean sandwiches. Oh wow, these are really cool. There's Chihiro. They have all the paper birds from Spirited Away. And there's Haku.
ありがとう Ice cream in the rain. <laughs> We're getting a quick snack right now in the cafe before we head back to Nagoya for an actual late lunch, early dinner. We did most of the stuff in the warehouse. We still have Mononoke to find. I'm not sure where it is. This experience feels a little bit half baked, especially compared to the Ghibli Museum, but That makes sense because the museum's been around much longer and they're still in phase one or the first year of the park. So a lot of stuff is still being built out. They're just letting people in as they're doing that. I still think it was a cool experience. It would be better if we could have seen everything, but it's okay. We've got to see what we can now and hopefully can come back in a few years when everything is a little bit more complete. Oh, we got the fried chicken sandwich. Oh, got a little kiki flag. More coffee because we're tired. <clears throat> How you doing, babe? Fantastic. Oh, they have the giant spider thing. And the big pig. Take this plane. Just have to figure out where the airport is. Let's go. <laughs> Misbehave. <laughs> Slap you with this. Oh, <laughs> hot. Tastes like um, grilled rice. <laughs> 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 Have all of the local dishes from Nagoya that we can try. So Nagoya is really known for miso items and there's a couple other dishes so we want to try out some of the local specialties. So we're going to try out some of the miso oden skewers and then get some of the chicken wings which is a Nagoya classic and then also get kishimen which is their noodle. Okay, we got our oden, which is basically hot pot, and it's stewed in red miso, which is the tradition here in Nagoya. I think this one is the beef tendon. We have egg, we have radish, and fried tofu. Excited for the beef tendon. Oh, the stew looks like very 
intense. I feel like I've I want something similar before. I want like bread with this. It tastes. I feel like it's gonna be Chinese. Yeah, like great. Uh, yeah. Mm. Definitely had this mm. before. My grandma tries to make stuff like it's like pig feet usually. That's good though. The miso is good. I like the. It's very like deep, rich flavor. We got our wings. Deep fried chicken wings. 